My name is Brianna Gomez. I am a freshman in my second semester. I am double majoring and double minoring, so I am majoring in psychology and art with minors in marketing and business law. So, while studying at the U, I found it's a very inclusive environment. People are from all over here, and that's so lovely to be around people like me who are also like from all over. I'm from the Bahamas, but I have roots around the Caribbean from Cuba, Costa Rica, Jamaica, and the Bahamas. When I was three years old, one of my grandmothers used to make straw baskets and sell them in a shop back home on one of the what we say family islands which is one of the smaller less inhabited islands in the Bahamas so she would weave baskets there and when I spent time with her growing up as a four-year-old five-year-old she teach me how to weave baskets the way she used to and sell them and then my other grandmother I would sit with my grandmother and she teach me how to paint by colors with the color by number books and that really sparked my interest in art having the two of them really just bestow onto me what they had learned about the arts and like their love for it right now I'm working on a series called Disappear Preparing Eden, which is a series of climate change, referring to climate change, referencing climate change, about basically how the Bahamas and Miami and most of Florida, South Florida, will be underwater for the next 50 years due to the way it looks climate change is going. Sadly, and that being said, the places where I spent most of my childhood and young adulthood both being submerged underwater is horrific to think about, to say the least. And I hope that this series can bring about a change and a conversation at the least about what needs to be done and how fast it needs to be done. I'm hoping to continue as I've been doing, run my own business, have my own company. I want to be a mogul for young artists and especially young people like myself who are multicultural backgrounds and who struggle with fitting into whichever culture they have. Like when you have more than one culture, it's hard to say you're part of like, for me example, part of four different cultures because both my parents are both like 50-50 of each of those cultures. It's hard when you say, someone says, oh, where, where are you from? What are you? Well, who are you people? Like stuff like that. And I have to answer with four different countries. They look at me like, <laughs> so it's really funny. But um, basically to help people not have that reaction is my goal through my artwork to help bring about inclusivity, understanding, and bring about the conversation, like I said before. Kyle Throwbridge in his class, um, Painting 301. His class really brought me the aha moment. His class helped me discover my Disappearing Eden series. It was, we were doing Rousseau painting in his class where he really allowed me to be true to myself and my Caribbean roots and allowed me to express my concern for my sinking island and sinking South Florida in my artwork in his class, which was so amazing. It was, the opportunity really brought about this whole new series and venture that I have. And I'm very thankful for him for introducing me to that artist and really helping me with develop my concept and now having a series.